He to a woman's heart. Unexpected gift at an unexpected time. My unexpected gift, but not the key to my heart. This thing not working even when I change out the power supply. Sometimes the expected gifts are the gifts we really need. Like this morning roundup, guitar schnick. And this is that alien wolf skull from early in the series. Very satisfyingly, Big Moai is done. And Little Moai is done. Hey Zeus. And the D20. Octo guitar. Big shark. Let him out and let him in. And big shark. Let's tape off the red part so that we can do the yellow on the fries. Let's package this guitar octo. Took a second, but we finally got the orange pop listed as a new product. First product listed in the new place. All right, we golded up the crown. Now we're gonna tape that off. The rest is going black and white. We did the ice cream part. Time to tape that off and do the cone. Let's just say ding. Fries are done. These fries are going to Hawaii. And here we've got a guitar octo. We've got an Einstein. It's nice out. It's been a minute. I think we are going to try some, try to find some more boxes to paint things on. Oh man, did we get a hole in one? Did we get lucky the first time? Wow, that is too much box. There's no way I'm fitting that in the car. It's pretty clean trash though. Maybe there's something in here. Oh yeah, it's for some kind of chairs. Yeah, I don't know, it's kind of just one giant box. Here's this, but this is just 2D constructed. No, nope, not so lucky. It's okay. There's more dumpsters left in the sea. There's a really bad one back there. That's CeCe's Pizza, I think. What do we got here? An old Galaga thing. I'd maybe use that, except it's real heavy. Yeah, no dice there either. Old couches and stuff. I don't know, just not a good day for this. All right, this is behind a Harbor Freight. We might find some good stuff here. Decent quality, but they're all real small. Man, I don't know if I can reach them, but there looks like there's some options. This box is full. I don't know what a drywall panel hoist is, but there's one in there. Here we go. Some giant popcorn boxes. We've got a few of them in there. Yep. Yeah. I guess that'll work. It's something. Everybody walks the old dogs around here. Maybe I'll be one of them one of these days. Got a guitar schnick and another guitar schnick. Here we've got a dwarf pipe. We got a Marcus Aurelius and more fries. Beautiful. And let's paint these guys. Not him, he's painted. Oof, solid day of work. Really getting it done, getting caught up on everything. Ooh.
hopefully next week we will probably be able to take our uh, Lufkin, Texas thrift trip. Just don't want to do it while we're still backed up, but we're getting there. Join the Discord, link below. Mopar Dude says, how about a large bear claw for coffee shops, sir? Mm. It does seem like a lot of people are into the idea of some large baked goods. I think we're gonna give, maybe we'll do a bear claw, maybe we'll do, I gotta think of like different muff, like I don't have a muffin yet. We should probably do a muffin. Silver 3DP says, Tom Cruise looks really good in white. You can see a lot of the details. Great video. Looks like you had a full day. Solid day on the books. Art Federson with the gratitude attitude. Grateful to have found another way to utilize 3D printing so that I can sh showcase and will make my project. Found another way to utilize 3D printing that I can showcase and will make my project reach the next level. Also, happy for the new F2 Ultra that my wife and I will be using to flesh out her new Etsy store. Cool, man. Dual Etsy stores. Or maybe sh only she has an Etsy store. I don't know. Congratulations. Being the man behind the woman who can do the magic feels pretty amazing. Sounds like a nice arrangement you got there. The Reasonable Gentleman says, Happy Sunday, M3. Happy Monday, Reasonable Gentleman. Spicy Barbecue. I collect vinyl records and found one yesterday called Wasp Sounds. When I got home and played it, I didn't think it sounded like anything like the sounds wasps make. That's when I realized I was playing the B-side. 13 days. Let's see, what am I grateful for today? Well, we did get the first new product on the board today. And, oh yeah, the Psychedelic Alien. You remember that from a few episodes ago? A person left a glowing review with photos and everything. A lot of times with these custom projects, if I'm going to list them as a product, I like to kind of do it after the person gets their thing so that the big reveal isn't them seeing it on Etsy. It's like when they're opening it, of course, because that's more exciting. So I will probably list the Psychedelic Alien for sale tomorrow. So we're starting off next week strong. Man, maybe we'll design some new products tomorrow. We need to do that. I got some custom stuff that needs to get done. That's probably a good thing to knock out tomorrow. But yeah, we're getting caught up. My hair is less on fire than it was. All in all, it's really coming together. That's what I'm grateful for. Time to tell me what you're grateful for. Tell me in the comments what you are grateful for today. All you gotta do would be in the gratitude gang. Be grateful for something. I'm grateful that you guys have been grateful in the comment section, and it's time to be full of grateful. Man, I really am feeling like way less pressure. I know I've talked to death about this, but it's like when I moved, did the move, it's just like, oh man, gotta get all this stuff done, gotta get all this stuff done. And it's really starting to feel like much more calm and much more tranquil which is what you want. We just need to be cranking out new products and stuff. Once we get going, it's gonna be crazy. You guys will see. We got a really great system. We got more space to paint. I will also say increased space in the painting realm makes it easier to paint. When you're in a less cramped environment and stuff and you can have everything laid out and you can really, a big thing is like you can get around the object. like. If you can put the object on a stand here and then go from that angle, go from that angle, go from that angle, you know, hit it from all sides, that really, really helps. And that space is big enough that like we can do that. I'm, it's gonna make so much stuff faster. Christmas is gonna go way better. It's really a big deal. It's cool that you guys are around for the ride, along for the ride. And it's also cool that I'm going to be able to go watch this in the future and just see how we figured out how to do everything. But yeah, the increased painting space is really non-trivial. Probably next few days, we're going to get that place completely plasticed up. We still have some gaps and stuff. And then I'm going to make the doorways. We're going to make the doorways so that uh, the dust kind of doesn't get everywhere. It's really, really exciting. Man, I'm feeling super optimistic. And we've got Dunkin' Donuts so close. 
life is just becoming perfect. I don't know, I guess I got a little extra gust of gratitude there. Might as well put it on film. But yeah, let me know in the comments what you are grateful for. We are the Gratitude Gang. You know we drop the, these encouraging, affirming episodes every single day. I'm here to edify, exhort, and comfort according to my nature. Catch you on the next episode. You guys are special and great. Peace out.